Sis, sis, sis. You. Indeed, me. I am me, and you are you. You really are a stubborn mortal. Well. Ooh, creepy ass laugh. We will see. And with that, let's leave a little save. Um, game? I don't know why this game is so glitchy. Game. Game. Um. The save killed the game! Yeah! Oh, sweet. It came back. Wow. This game is not really that buggy. I swear to God, guys. It's probably my recording equipment and uh, it's not having a good time with it. If I had a guess. But anyway, we're going to go to the right of the path. And then we're going to go up and head to the left. Because I believe that is a dead end, which will have an item that we need. Quickly recovering my stamina. And as you can see, there's a pretty, pretty shiny shiny in there. But guarded by a gate. So let's head on up. Hey, another spirit. Wisp, Sprite, I don't know what you are still. And it's leading us to a lover that we could kind of already have seen because there's only one path to see. Ah, uh, Ceres, thank you. There you go. And low on stamina, now I'm walking really slow. Ugh, I really hate this mechanic, actually. It's pretty annoying. I have to walk really, really slow. And once more, little dude, it's like, hey, look at this, pick it up! Now, when I first played this game, I actually thought this was a uh, piece of poo. So I literally kept calling it crap, turd, and shit. So, as far as I'm concerned, and as far as this LP is concerned, let's pick up the piece of shit. Let's pick the shit up. Mine. See, don't. I think you can go up straight up just yet, if I'm recalling correctly. Oh, indeed, and I am right. Because there's a plank over here. And recovering stamina. Because why not? Alright, hop. Hop. Here we are. Plank. Sir S, thank you. Alrighty. And luckily once we get into the cave in the middle, we're actually pretty much done with the right hand side. And up we go. Um Oh, I need to push enter, I'm stupid. Sometimes it's kinda of hard to know when you can just go straight and other times just you need to push enter to go. And once more, we leave a plank for us to walk across, so we can pick this shit up. And now we're done with this area. And head back down. 
Can I make it before my stamina runs out? Seven, four, three. Oh no, I couldn't. Darn it. Slowly and surely, walking to the other side. Yeah, this mechanics kind of sucks. Maybe like make the stamina bar go slower when you use it. I don't know. Just because I feel like it runs out so fast. Ooh, another pretty, pretty, shiny, shiny thing. I want it. Who needs it? Hmm? How odd. A lamppost in the middle of nowhere? This can't be just a normal cave. Well, it belongs to the deity, so I imagine they kind of did a few things. It actually looks like those b ones back at home. And here we are, entering to another flashback. And here's Oria. Come on, Saras! Don't fall behind! And slowly we walk towards Oria. You are supposed to keep an eye- Oh, that's Oria. You are supposed to keep an eye on me after all. That's exactly what I'm doing. Is that so? <laughs> yes. Good. Excuse me a second. Let's put the kitty down. There you go. H hey! Oh? Didn't you want me to stay close? And now we begin the game of tag. Yes, I was off to with that. Shut up. Tag, you're it. Caught you, silly one. <laughs> I miss her warmth. She had the greatest bear hugs. Alrighty, since there's nowhere else to go but through this cave, let us enter. Hey, there's a piece of turd over there! Well, we can't reach it. Which is fine. And let my stamina bar rise back up. Rise it up, 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 rise it up, up, up. Let's see, and head on straight up. Because there's a lever here. And activate it. And once more, let the stamina increase. Yeah, this stamina kind of sucks. Alrighty, head on over here. Let's see. Ah, there's a gate! Just as my stamina dies. Don't know why I went through the upward path. I could have got, just gone down. Here we are, and here's a plank. Mine. This plank said mine. All the planks are mine, and no one else could have them. <laughs> and reactivate that lever. The gate goes down. Hmm. 
And slow. Walk it very, very slow. Oh, stamina. Why must you leave so soon? Could you stay just a little longer? And what's more? Let's pick this shit up! And there's one more item we have to get, which we previously saw. And then we'll be able to go to the room that is actually straight ahead from the save point. Head on down. Walk across this bridge. Phew. Doesn't break. Kind of anti-climatic. Yeah, the stamina really, really sucks. I'll complain about that so much. This should work. And once more, for the final time, let's pick this shit up. And back to the flowery little garden right here. A lot of the memories in here are actually really, really cute, and I really like them. Granted, they're just like small little snip bits of our Ceres and Oria's life, but they're still really cute. And now we can head up. And by heading straight up, it takes us to a forest. A nice, a pretty, everything's glowing and shiny. And look! It's Aurea! Hey Aurea, give us a kiss! She looks so sad. Huh. Oh. Sad. But look! A pedestal! Right next to Aurea! Hmm. 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 I bet this belongs here. Wait, could the pieces of shit we picked up actually not be pieces of shit? Hey! We got something that looks like a pair of legs! That looks similar to ours! Ooh, nice pair of hips! Just like ours! Ooh, and a nice torso! Just like ours. And last but not least, the ultimate piece of shit. Hell yeah! Alright, alright, jokes aside, we made ourselves as a statue. Done. Huh? Ah, uh, the white light! It's blinding! This does actually look a lot better. <laughs> Soon. Soon I'll be with her again. Aww. But, in order to be with Aurea, we must continue on. Uh oh. A ditch. Or a big black abyss. What is happening? A path made of flowers? Well, alright. I guess. Hey, it works for me. As long as they stand still until I get it over, we're good. I know that 
not laugh. Well, well, stubborn mortal. We need to make this a bit more of a challenge, it seems. Yes, everything's been pretty freaking easy. You, you deities are not making this hard at all. I mean, maybe that first one's up to debate, but eh. Is this just a game to them? Well, this is a game to me, Ceres. But the deities are actually right. Um, they have made it more challenging. In fact, they've actually made it more deadlier. To where you can now actually die. And so we shall save. Uh, right here. And so we shall head on up. And now, the Shadow Man. Don't touch me! Don't touch me! One single touch from these guys and it's instant death for you. So you kinda wanna be careful. But look, there's another pretty pretty. Next to a pretty pretties. I miss her. So much. And once more, as per usual, flashback time! Oh, we seem to be in a forest. It's so dark out here. But sneaking out in the middle of the night is also very exciting. <laughs> Let's just hope we're not getting ourselves into trouble. Don't worry. We should be almost there. And as we head over to the edge of the cliff, slowly and surely, see over the horizon. With a bunch of trees and a starry sky. Wow! What a view! Pretty, right? Yes! This is wonderful! And well worth any trouble. Ah, what a pretty moon to light our way to the night. Thank you, Ceres. The pleasure is mine. Oh, Oreo, Oreo seemed to really like that. on down and go straight up. We don't want to miss, mess with the Shadow Man. The Shadow Man can go away. But they're not. They're going to stay here. There's a Shadow Man right over there, but we're going to leave him alone. Because we have a mutual understanding of if he leaves me alone, I leave him alone. And vice versa. Wow! This sure does look a bit familiar. Home sweet home, huh? I don't have time to get distracted by things like these. That. Hey, Shadow Man, what are you doing here? Creepy. At least this one isn't after me. And, can 
enter this building. We're gonna ignore everything else and just head on straight up. Let's see. Unreadable, let's see. There you go. Oh. A silver key. A key. Nice. Got ourselves a key. That's all you need to go into this house for. Nothing else. And then we're gonna quickly go straight up. Gotta hustle along. And enter this dark, creepy ass hallway. Go away. And here we are, in a library. Behold, there's more keys! A key! Might be useful. Indeed there is. And there are actually a total of three keys in this area, because there are three locked doors. Well, if you want to get technical, four locked doors and four keys, but three silver keys for three doors. And the third one is right here. Oh. There's a key in here. And voila! Oh, look. More sparkles next to a pair of books. Let's see what we've got here. Hmm? Oh, I've seen this book before. It's been one of that brat's favorites. The brat's favorites? Who's the brat? Certainly hope you don't mean Aurea. I mean, Aurea's been pretty chill. She's been pretty cool. And you're doing this all for her. Why would you call her a brat? That's pretty rude, Ceres. Seriously. Very rude. Aurea, she's just checking out books. Why, why, why would you say that? Oh ho. Perhaps it's not Aurea we were talking about. Perhaps this is the brat. Slowly walking towards Aurea. So here you ha so here you've been hiding all day. Yeep. Oh, it's you. Yes, me. Oria, we need to talk. You sound concerned. I am. Oria, you are distracted lately. And slowly and surely we're sneaking on in. You've always been such a duteous, reliable, and pure person. I fear you're changing. Your father is worried too. Aurea, nothing should be more important to you than your duties. Mm. You worry too much, my dear. Is it so? And why did you beg me to stay quiet about the fact that you're sneaking out at night? I'm sorry. I didn't know what a burden I did put on you. Whew. Close call. Oh yeah, you... You're a lifesaver. Nope. Go away. Luckily, they don't see you. If they see you, they do a, like, a very small charge at you. So you really don't want to get too close to them. And stamina's gone. Now I'm walking pretty slow. But it's okay. I guess. Alright. 
This could work, because we used one of our keys. And it did. Let's check it on inside. And this is where another memory should pop up. One right after the other. <laughs> Not gonna lie, but this one kind of took me a while to figure out. I've been here before. Mostly because I couldn't find three keys, I can always find two. But I just didn't look hard enough. <laughs> or at least to a place that looks very sim similar to this one. And we vanished! We vanished over here. Music's so nice in this. This is perfect. So lovely. I. Oh, well, that Aurea still sings so lovely? I agree. Very lovely indeed. Oh, I guess it was Aurea saying that. I guess that. I like that song right there. It's so nice. There's always something about just uh, harm, uh, not harmful. Uh, uh, peaceful music playing with just like a nice little soft sound in the background. Good old times. I don't know what it is, just like, even like hums or hymns and oohs and ahs. It just always fascinates me compared to like actual uh, singing voices. Or, yeah, voicing. Maybe you stick this in now. Got it. Excellent. Open says me. Here we are with once more another memory. A lot of memories in this place. Look, a bed. I said, look, a bed. Comfy. I can't wait to get back home. Sleep on a bed, Jesus. When was the last time I slept? Don't answer that. A hairbrush? Uh, Uriah! Sh shouldn't I be the one that. Uh... Please relax, Ceres. You deserve to be cared for. And we're getting a hairbrush. Because our hair is monstrous. Usually, anyway. At least we puff it up to be so. I'm glad you became my guard. Oh! So this is kind of how. Uh, Oria and Ceres are together always, and it's because we're guarding her and protecting her with our life. Same. Are you alright? Yes. Don't worry. Now let me just hold you for a little longer, please. Feels like she's going through some hard times. But that's what we're here for. We're gonna hold her in our arms and just make her feel better. This one looks really looks like Aurea's. Aurea's. I wanted her to be happy. She was under so much pressure. She just wanted to get away from it all. Yeah, they did mention that Aurea does have some duties that she needs to perform. And uh, we could try entering that door, but it's a locked door that we can't enter right now. And I don't believe we could get e get the key either, so at least not yet. But if we head down here, 
We'll find a save. Hello, save. I'm come best buds with you. Alright, alright. Here's a little sprite. Spirit. Whatever you are. And there are shuttle men everywhere. But first, let's enter down here. There's a little sparkle. So many sparkles in this episode. Good. Or in this game. Ceres! Ceres, let's run away! No, I'm serious! Let's do it! Just like, what's going on? Yeah, I'm not controlling it by the way. This is all a cutscene. Oriel. My daughter. Oh, here comes Daddy. How could you do this to me? I'm so disappointed. That woman, she bewitched you, right? Say something! How could you lose sight of your duty? Being granted the chance to become an oracle is such an honor! Oh, so she expected to become an oracle! That's why she's under so much pressure. You are not allowed to care that much for one individual. You've been misled, right? My poor child. Don't worry. Everything will be alright. Ah, so Daddy wanted to take things into his own hands. So that's why he claimed us as a witch and wanted us dead. Hoping that would turn Oria back to not normal, I would say, but more like... Oh, I guess maybe normal is the correct term, I don't know. But here, we have a puzzle! And this one took me a little while to figure out. It's one of the harder, I say in quotation marks, puzzles. All you have to do is sound this one. Move on over here, across the floor. Oh, and if you land on any of the previous ones or off the uh, thing, it automatically restarts, so uh, be aware of that. But uh, go through four. Don't go on the last one. Go up. Go back to the right. Go up. Over. Down. Over. Up. Down. Over. Over. And go all the way down. Over and voila. Oh, it lights it up. Nice. And there are children, shuttle people. There are children, and yes, they are instant death. It sucks. Which kind of makes sense, though. There's no health bar in this game, so. And again, you could just avoid them, so eh, who cares? And out of stamina. Darn it. And now I believe we can head on over to the right. There's a well right there, but it just gives you a dialogue, it doesn't do anything for you, so it's kind of pointless to do anything. Also, here's a little, oops, little odd puzzle. It's not really specific as to what you're supposed to do, but just push the rock straight and then to the left. Voila! Yeah, I was kind of actually playing around and um, I didn't know this was actually work. I was like, I actually got this on my first try when I first played this. But look, a lever. Oh, nice. Yeah, really playing around with it. Just got it on my first try. 
Yeah, it's a little weird how you're how it, the game's supposed to expect you to know that automatically. But again, like I said, you could just kind of play around. Not that big of a deal. Oh, the fire is lit. The gate is down. <sighs> Finally, we got a gold key. Which is why I said technically there's four, and technically four locked doors. So we need this door. And we're gonna use a gold key on it. This golden key should do the trick. Ah, <sighs> great! And back through another dark hallway. Gotta hustle. Gotta get to Oria. She's the only thing we care, we care about. The only thing we came here for, the only thing we care about. The only reason why we want to live. Okay, I'm actually gonna save right here. And I'm just gonna let my stamina rise up. Why? Uh, you'll find out as soon as I go through here. And run away! Shadowman chasing you! Shadowman! 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 Run away! Alright. And we're gonna let my stamina raise once more. Because this area is actually pretty long. And run away! More Shadowman! An overabundance of shuttle men who need to stop and go away. Oh, hustle, hustle, hustle. Don't want to do with any of them. Ah, uh, stop your hissing. It's rude. Ah. Uh, oh, luckily we're at the end. No, not giving chase. Oh, nice. Once more, guess what I'm gonna do? Can you guess? I'm actually doing it right now. Can you guess what I am doing, viewer? That is right. I am letting my stamina increase. I'm twirling like an idiot. Oh, don't want to move too close. Okay. Huh! Run away! Oh my god, there's abundance of them. Oh god. All in this one tiny ass area, too. Uh, run away! Run away! Run away! Run away! Hey! There's a buddy! Telling us the light is over here. Let's go through it. Uh, shuttle men. Freaking shuttle men. Thinking they own the place. Rude. Oh, looks like our friend is uh, leading us to the outside world. As he fades. Outside world? Does that mean we've finished? Oh, sorry for not being in the center, buddy, but whatever. Well, well. Oh, it forces us in the center anyway, so who cares? <laughs> you have come far, little mortal. You traversed our realm. It seems now we will have to let go. At least, until we meet again. <laughs> Someday. Someday. Someday far away, hopefully. For now, we grant you freedom. Until we meet again. Goodbye. Goodbye.
here once more. Alive! And look! It's a bunny! It's a bunny running away. How adorable. Bunny. Look! It's a squirrel! A squirrel! There are trees! There are squirrels! There are rocks! There's life! I want to talk to you. How cute! Ah, oh, flowers and butterflies and air, the cliff, and there are birds. There's freaking birds, guys. We did it. We got through. We're alive and have matter. Woo! Freaking shadow man. Trying to give our life trouble. How rude of them. But that did stop us. For the power of love. Conquers all. Ceres and Oria. Why are you freezing? You did this at the beginning of the game and you're doing this again at the end? Come on now. Alright, good. This didn't stick around too long. <laughs> that would be the worst way to, uh, to stop a game. It's just like frozen solid. A kid doesn't move and completely crashes down. That would be just the worst way to end a game. Granted, I would probably have to like maybe edit it and redo it, but again, it would suck. It's like you're almost finished, game. You're almost finished. We're finished, and then crash. But we didn't get through the credits or the seeds or anything. Cries. With music by Ryan Foot. Your champ? I have no idea what that word was or meant. But, uh, good job with the music. The music's actually pretty nice in here. I really like it. Some more than others, but they're actually really nice. Credits. I, what I also like is that um, it shows you little clips of Ceres moving through from where she was into town. So it looks familiar. <laughs> Fully somewhat familiar. Special thanks to my family and my beloved muse. And thank you, the player, for joining Ceres on this journey. Aw, you're welcome. Thanks for making this. If I recall, this game is actually free, so you can easily, quickly just download it and play it and have a quick time. As you can tell, it's not a very long game, but... Well, I do enjoy this game. The music's pretty solid. The characters were actually pretty decently fleshed out, thanks to the memories. Or at least, mostly with Aria, I feel. Ceres is a little... could have been a little bit more, but I'll take what I can get. The graphics aren't too bad. They're actually pretty nice. Of course, I am speaking in RPG Maker standards. Standards. They're actually pretty good. Not too bad. Look, the trees, they actually look fairly decently detailed instead of really badly pixelated. Like the trees at the bottom, I would say those are normally pixelated. Uh, something you would expect in a, this type of game. But no, it's actually pretty smooth in most areas. Behold! There's Aurea! Looking across the land, wondering. Ceres, why? But as she turns, she walks down to the road. Kent believes what she is seeing. Her beloved Ceres 
has returned. She's overfilled with emotion, and she runs towards her love! And as a white flashing light blinds us all. Okay, seriously, go away. Alright, game. Haha, you had your fun. Come on. Okay, I was joking about the crashing. I'm I'm dead serious. I, I'm I was just joking. Can you not crash, please? Okay, you had your fun. Come on. I really don't want to do this again. Oh for the love of God. Come on! I was joking, game. Come on. Come on, please. Please? What is wrong with this game? What's wrong with my computer not activating this? Come on. Hold on a second. There we go! Missed a little bit of it, but not too much. With tears of joy in her eyes, Arya jumps into Ceres' arms, embracing her. So happy that Ceres has returned. Oh, everyone is so happy. Better not freeze again, I swear to god. There we go. Faded to the light. Man, I have no idea what is wrong with this. And why it's so bad. I I'm pretty sure it's more my computer. And maybe my software or something. I don't think it's the game. So, my apologies, everybody. It, I'm li limited to so much software. Oh, ho! A pair of doors open in the middle of the night. Ceres leaves out. Leaves out. That makes sense, for sure. Let's roll with it. Ceres looks back at the gates. And out comes Oria. They look in, into each other's eyes. And they head out into the unknown, side by side. Ceres has overcome everything that was thrown at her, and so rightfully she has one, Oria. And Oria is free to live whatever life she wants. And that is the end of Ceres and Oria. Oh, sorry for the little hiccup right there. That kind of sucks. Oh, God. <laughs> I was seriously joking about the game crashing at the end. Oi. Stupid game. Well, again, it's probably not the game, it's probably my computer. It used to work so well, but now it's been having problems as of late, so I need to figure out how to fix that. Ooh. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed play watching. I enjoyed playing this. It's a, again, very short, simple little game. Not too hard or difficult. A nice little time waster, and one that's for free, too, so can't go wrong. But again, something that's for free. Uh, I feel like the characters were pretty good. The music was really good. I really enjoyed it. The graphics, not too bad, not too shabby. But, what is it for this LP? I am Terry the Fox. You are the viewer. And I hope to see you next time.